EV manufacturers are at a big risk. Their once strong grip on the market at 81% is plummeting to just 58% by the end of the decade. This massive shift is orchestrated by Chinese car manufacturers, storming the automotive battleground with affordable and cutting-edge EVs. And by 2030, Chinese car makers aim to grab a third of the global new car sales pie. But here's the real shocker. Elon Musk, the titan behind Tesla is sounding the alarm. In a recent earnings call, Musk unleashed a stark warning. If there are no trade barriers established, Chinese car makers will pretty much demolish most other car companies in the world. In just two years, the annual sale of electric vehicles in China has catapulted from 1.3 million to a staggering 6.8 million. That's not just growth, it's a transformative shift. Marking 2022 as the eighth consecutive year where China proudly claimed the title of the world's largest market for EVs. In stark contrast, the United States, a heavyweight in its own right, lagged behind, selling a mere 800,000 EVs. Now, picture this. BYD, a Chinese powerhouse, didn't just enter the scene, it dominated it. In the final quarter of 2023, BYD surpassed even the mighty Tesla to claim the throne as the world's top-selling EV brand. This isn't just a victory, it's a declaration of China's supremacy in the automotive sector, surpassing Japan as the world's largest car exporter. In response, Tesla isn't retreating, it's gearing up for a showdown. A new, more affordable model is set to emerge, poised to challenge the surging tide of Chinese electric vehicles. But more on that later. The stakes are higher than ever, and the competition is fierce. Buckle up as we delve into the electrifying evolution of China in the EV market, where every statistic is a twist, and every development a revelation. In the aftermath of our electrifying introduction, let's turn the spotlight to the automotive heavyweights grappling with unforeseen challenges. Ford's electric vehicle division unveils a staggering operating loss of $1.3 billion in a single quarter, eclipsing the gloom of the preceding quarter's $1.1 billion loss. This downturn paints a grim picture of financial distress, with Ford attributing it to their hefty investment in EVs amid sluggish market dynamics. Shifting gears to General Motors, with their big plans of producing 400,000 EVs by mid-2024. Guess what? That plan has gone up in smoke. The demand for GM's EVs is hauntingly elusive. In Q3 2023, GM accelerated electric vehicle production to about 32,000 units, a commendable 40% surge from the previous quarter. However, the plot twist is stark. Their sales only grew by 28%, signaling a red flag that demands attention. Meanwhile, Volkswagen and Saga takes a dramatic turn. Jobs vanish as around 300 temporary workers at the Zwickau plant receive pink slips, while the future remains uncertain for an additional 2,000 temporary staff. Adding fuel to the fire, in the first quarter of 2023, profits took a nosedive by a staggering 31%, despite a harmonious sales revenue melody in Europe and North America. Prepare for a shift in the automotive landscape, folks! Affordable electric cars straight out of China have swiftly gained ground in Europe, and they might be gearing up to conquer American driveways next. Why does it matter? Well, the Biden administration is not just encouraging a rapid embrace of electric vehicles, they're also eyeing a reduction in U.S. reliance on Chinese EV supply chains. In a U.S. market where the average EV price is cruising around $55,000, there's a significant gap at the bottom for budget-friendly cars, and Chinese brands like BYD and Li Auto are eyeing that sweet spot. But here's the twist. The U.S. faces a challenge. Despite the push for a speedy increase in EV sales, there's a shortage of domestic minerals and components to meet the proposed demand. So, are we about to see a wave of affordable Chinese EVs rolling down American streets? China raced ahead and now holds the top spot as the world's biggest car exporter. They sent an incredible 5 million vehicles worldwide just last year. But why this electric vehicle export explosion? 
It's a double whammy of supply and demand. On the supply side, Chinese automakers are sitting on a gold mine of excess capacity, with factories capable of churning out around 10 million vehicles annually. That's right, they're ready to roll. Now here's where it gets even more interesting. Chinese companies are unveiling sales targets that scream one thing. They're on a mission to expand their global footprint. China's very own BYD is gearing up to snatch the crown as the top dog in making battery electric vehicles, potentially knocking Elon Musk's Tesla off its pedestal. This isn't just a win for BYD, it's a blazing victory lap for Chinese car makers on the world stage. From a once obscure name in the car scene back in 1995, BYD has transformed into a powerhouse. They started with rechargeable batteries, took a leap into car production, and now they're making waves globally. Here's the secret sauce. BYD's strength lies in its all-encompassing production model. They've got their hands in everything, from batteries and semiconductors to putting the cars together. This means they can whip up cost-effective electric vehicles like no one else. And guess what keeps the cost down? China's supercharged EV supply chain. BYD can produce a vehicle for a whopping 10,000 euros less than their European counterparts. Talk about a competitive edge! They've also mastered the art of staying ahead in the tech game, especially in software and the speedy development of new models. But hold on to your seats. The competition at home is fierce, especially in the mid-market electric range of around $28,000 to $42,000. BYD isn't just stopping at being the best. They're constantly sharpening their skills to stay ahead in the race. So as BYD gears up for the throne, Elon Musk, the maestro behind Tesla just sounded the alarm. In a recent earnings call, Musk didn't mince words, warning that Chinese car makers are no small threat. In fact, they could potentially demolish most other car companies in the world if trade barriers aren't set up. Now, why the concern? Well, Musk has skin in the game. Last year, he kicked off a price war to attract consumers facing high borrowing costs. While this move aimed to win hearts, it did a number on Tesla's profit margins, causing a bit of worry among investors. And guess what added fuel to the fire? BYD, backed by Warren Buffett, swooped in with its budget-friendly models and diverse lineup, stealing Tesla's thunder and becoming the top-selling electric vehicle company last quarter. But it's not all smooth roads for Tesla. The once lightning speed revenue growth hit the brakes, ticking up by just 3% to $25.2 billion after years of zooming ahead. Feeling the need for speed, Tesla slashed prices across the board in 2023, cutting the tag on everything from the Model 3 to the popular Model Y by more than 25% to drum up interest. However, the market didn't exactly applaud Tesla's moves. Investors hit the brakes hard, sending the share price down over 10% and poof, over $50 billion vanished from Tesla's market value. But hold on, Elon Musk isn't letting the company competition steal the spotlight. In a strategic move to tackle the growing rivalry, Tesla is gearing up to unveil a game-changing model, the Redwood. Picture this, an affordable entry-level compact crossover SUV, set to hit the roads with a brand new platform that promises to slash production costs. Elon Musk himself spilled the beans, confirming that Tesla is revving up production for its next-gen electric vehicle right in the heart of Texas. Brace yourselves, we're looking at the second half of 2025 for this electrifying debut. Insiders are buzzing with excitement, hinting that Redwood might just be the much-anticipated Tesla model with a budget-friendly price tag of $25,000. It's not just a car, it's a crucial piece in Tesla's grand strategy. Now, let's talk architecture. The new kit on the block is NV9X, set to be the backbone not only for Redwood but also for a lineup of other vehicles, including an affordable robo-taxi. The production wheels are set in motion at Tesla's Giga Texas facility facility, and the plan is to expand the electrifying vibes to other sites, including Giga Berlin and the potential addition of a brand new factory in India. Are we witnessing a fundamental change in the global car market? The stage is now set for a thrilling competition between Western and Eastern automotive giants. How will this high-stakes race shape the future of driving? I've just shared a video on some jaw-dropping news that could shake up the entire EV industry. Check it out if you want to be truly surprised by what's about to happen with EVs.